Hola, I'm Afani here. Um, this is not how we usually start our videos, but here we are uh, outside starting a video. So we started fencing up this place and so far we've done so much today we want to finish up on the fencing and close up the back but before we can do that we can't do that today we'll have to do that tomorrow because before we can do that we have to create the pathway for the gate um the gate that's being that's going to be in the entrance oh it's actually a good thing that i started from here because these gates are finally going up um when i tell you when I tell you someone is looking for me, eh, that is a direct translation. Because you remember, these gates, um, they were like the first things we did over here. Because we are like, oh, let's fix the entrance. Because we'd been told the entrance was going to be on that side. But then later on that changed and I was told that where the gates were, that's going to be my entrance. Because they will need that entrance. Because upon whatever when we opened that place up we found another gate at the front and we're like oh cool we already have a gate over here so that's fine but then um this guys wanted to use this shamba and it was gonna have to be accessed by a lot more people other than just them and i was like i did not want to have to share a gate and then also um due to the division of land and whatever in the area because the the compound the plot next door belongs to someone completely different there needs to be a road in between here so i was told if i put my gate there um in the future it might become a problem because there's supposed to be a road there so i'll have to start figuring out my way in my way out so i was like it's okay it's fine um because i'd paid like those handy people to kind of just um toboa like remove all that shrubby whatever thingy i was like it's fine because um Coming back to this side was still going to be a bit cheaper than the amount of money I had actually spent on that side because it's just putting up the gate, putting back up, like we are returning the gate where we removed it, the main gate, which is going to be the gate that we had removed. So that's going back up um, on the road, but then I, I want a secondary gate, which is going to be the, the gate that leads into the compound. So I'm going to have a driveway where you guys see me walk sometimes, I think, I hope. Uh, we're going to have a driveway and so we have the second gate and the first gate so the second gate we're building that today because i want the gate to be sort of see-through i want to be able to see if someone walks in through the main gate and they are somewhere in between in the driveway if i'm in the compound or in the house i can see through this gate so so that like there's no it's not like a hidden spot where someone can come and chill and whatever and you wouldn't know if that makes sense so when i was saying kunam tananta futa what we had done is because i was like since the gate used to be there and the trumas are there the fundis are here and the trumas are there my plan was let's just remove that key slab from the column the kokoto or whatever we bakisha the truma now we just pour in new kokoto or whatnot right we did that um like thursday ish because we were planning to get started on this work on monday so monday we are walking there to go now you know so the fundi who's supposed to do the thing is here and someone stole the trumas someone literally came and cutted and went with them and that's why i think because now it's becoming a lot what were many zoyana you know how to spend any kuzoyana spend it kuzoyana trumas are expensive right now construction materials went up like from may from april so i wanted to show you the fencing we've been doing the fencing so this side so our gate is going to be here remember our trees so this is where our secondary gate is going to be and then now 
this side we've fungered oh they fungered this thing outside we wanted we wanted it ukundani because we are repurposing this wire meshes because one they are stronger than the the ones that are in the market right now so my plan is to because this one had started growing i will just pull it from uko we'll be able to so we are repurposing them for the gate that doesn't have all the whatevers like the see-through gate so we've done so this is the njia that the, the other njia that that guy the farm hand had nini had made there was no njia here because that used to be the njia they used to use so i closed it because it's like now you have to go around into the shamba did they listen no they came and started njia here that was one of them so you see our fence is really coming along it's looking snatched <laughs> my compound is finally being closed off this part right here this was another njia so like the guys they used the thing is to throw cause so my plan is to plant along this line this way so that now we have the shrubs on that side and then we have a hedge that's also growing on this side and then this the fence thing becomes it's like a midsection it's cutty cutty um but I like that, you know, there's a distance between what, like someone who's on that side and on this side. Because it's going to be a very thick hedge, which I like. This is where those thieves walked out through. Okay, they walked through here. That's the second year he made. Huh? Like that was not enough. He had another one here for him. Like, look, that's the road there. This was closed up. It had like some barbed wire thingy like this. It was closed up, but no. He came and did this. So, yeah. And there was also another one here for him and the Ngombez. May I tell you, this man was testing my patience. So, we have done this. So, the back, right now, um, I keep bending to get out. This section back here, this is where I want to have my... I want to build the Nini over here this corner because you see that's the house the house is over there so this is the corner where i want to have my workshop um so that it's away from the house that way when i'm working here and you see i have um someone in the house i have guests someone sleeping or whatever uh my noise doesn't really disturb them yeah that's where we are the bamboo tree is bambooing treeing Okuivi, the grass has sort of started growing. So we had limad after removing this shrubby thing. So now we want to plant new grass over here from like other spots as we still remove these things. And then, because we're putting up the gate, I want us to start working on the driveway, have some flowers over there. Also, because it's raining. Sorry, uh, we can do this. Because it's also raining when we plant things now like this is a good time for them to grow because one i don't have to water them myself uh because there's rain and they're just going to be watered i called the guys um who need to come and mow the lawn they're busy because i was hoping they'd come today because it's like a holiday and i was sure i was going to be here but they're busy so they said they're going to come on saturday because that's the day that they have so they'll come saturday morning which is good because then the gates will be done um and everything so because actually that's what i wanted i wanted them to come do it after the fencing and the gating thingy is done okay now the fundies are here let me go talk to them and then we see what's up you know that i want to be good for you you know that i want to be good for you i do but sometimes someone was bad for me sometimes someone was bad oh can't you see I'm just being weak buying uh seedlings for the fence this is what we've isn't it what is it hakia sarigna that's that's the name of this plant 
So that's what we'll be using. I saw it summer and it looks very, very nice once it grows. And it's also very fast growing. So this is what we're picking. Hakia Sarigna. Hey. Okay. We'll also be picking some fruit seedlings. So these are the tree tomatoes. Uh, this one, I've been told they're like some form of peach. Um, you know these ones? If you don't know these ones, and you're Kenyan, I'm disappointed in you. When you are doing ni mapera, we've climbed a tree. Um, then these ones, I don't know. Oh, they're called what? They're not blackberries, but they look like them. Um, as we call them, dare. Uh, in Kuk, I don't know the name, but I know they they almost look like blackberries, but they're not blackberries. They're smaller, and they turn like a darkish red once they're ripe. And then let me show you the ninis over here. The cedar trees look amazing. I wish they didn't take so long to grow. I'd have taken this and used them for my fencing. But they take the longest when it comes to growing. But look at this. Guys, is how old size is it? Panda around when? Two years. This is two years. Hiya. Nando inafika hapa? Wa two years. Na hii Cyprus iko how old? Eh. So hii na take how long to grow? I take long pia. Ndachukua kaa mbili za nini? Ndio nilikuwa na za Christmas tree ile nyingine ilikufa. Haikupandwa vizuri. Mm. So you, oh, so you, is it men's size in Dom Tatuzia Christmas? Oh, kuna izi. Uh-huh. Ah. So is it Dom Tatuzia Christmas? This is where I got my Christmas tree. Ah, uh, so from that, you need to know this and then. Oh, okay. Interesting. It would be smart to buy them now because then it will be cheaper and then I keep it for myself. <laughs> also, we're getting some herbs. Um, so, yeah, this is uh, our local tree seedling buying spot. Okay. So, here we have some mint. They have a lot of mint. So, he's putting together different herbs for me, like he's putting together a variety. That way I can come, I'll come carry those ones on Friday. Because uh, today we're just getting the stuff for the fence. Um, so he's going to put together a nice variety for me. So we're also getting some flowers. Some plants that flower. Okay. So we're getting some of this for the, the driveway now. Because we're putting up the, the gate on Friday. So for the driveway, we'll get like, he said he's going to do a mix of this purple and the white. And then there's another plant, like he's shown me the marigolds and stuff. Like he has this one and then he has another type. So, yes. Oh, I see color lilies of which I don't need any because I have color lilies that actually grow behind the house. So that's fun. So, those are color lilies. Over there, I have this already growing behind the house. So, I'll just like maybe move them around. I have tried to see if I can grow some things. Oh, this is a nice, interesting flower. That's so cute. It looks like fire. Oh, wow. Can I, let me just. This is so cool. It looks like, right? It looks like fire, right? I'm not imagining this. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Sometimes we just crying, but we'll keep on trying. I know we'll be okay, because we got unconditional love. Damn, I don't want to be mad on you. No, I don't want to be mad on things you do. But sometimes I need what's best for me. Sometimes 
Sunny was best, baby, can't you see? Ilikuwa mrefu. Um, so we started the lawn thingy yesterday. I don't know if you can hear me, but now they've come to finish what was started, Jana. <laughs> <laughs> so we've done this part in the back. I didn't know they were going to cut out the sun. They said they were going to leave them, but it's because we want to control how those plants grow over there. They look like this, but we want to be able to control the growth. So they'll do all this cutting, and then we have to. Right now it doesn't look so pretty because now the dead grass is like drying on top but then they end up just raking all the grass and putting it off to the side somewhere so once they're done look at this guy yes Ziki was, was it you? Yes, Ziki Ziki's like Ziki follows me like I'm a like he's my shadow Ziki Love interrupted by tragedy Lost in the drought of nightfall Running in search of the remedy Trying to find her place the last like <clears throat> I just spoke for the last like three minutes and apparently I was not recording so we have to do this again I'm at Rain's house we've come to pick up twigs to start a fire we have like um hey now I'm tired like honestly this is the thing like the three minutes that's how the three minutes ended <laughs> I'm tired I don't know can I without touching I hope I can anyway uh we want to pick up some supplies for food Yesterday we had like a really cool lunch. We sat outside. We had lunch. It was meant to be brunch, but ended up coming lunch. We had some mimosas. Um, we had some nyama and rice, proper lunch, and then we also had dessert. Then um, now we're here just picking up some things. Then we go back. We want to go for a sunset walk because the sun was setting in a way. So we want to go for a walk as it sets, and then get back in the house, cook, get some work done, and everything. So um, yeah, I was. I was saying I have a, a cold. It was really bad yesterday. Um, <clears throat> I can't talk too much because then my throat gets really dry and I end up having to cough. <clears throat> but it started off with my throat feeling very weird. Then yesterday, I started like coughing and then the cough was so bad because like when I would cough, my chest would hurt. So it, and then my chest would hurt and then the cough is painful and then I would shed tears. It was it was a lot, but. Um, I'm a bit better today. I've been drinking lots and lots and lots of dawa because yo, when I tell you it's been a struggle. So yeah, I'm wait, I'm t I'm stalling as I wait for rain to finish. <laughs> but Bruno is already at Casablanca. He's been there since Jana. He brought himself. He left rain in the house and just ran up the road and came to the place. He just showed up. And then there's this random dog that's been showing up in the compound. Hey, me let me tell you. That dog is growling at me. It's like it wants to fight me at every turn. I am ready to go. So, see you on the other side when we're doing our sunset walk thingy. I forgot that I was taking you with me. But we're just wrapping up. I've picked this to 
helped me start the fire. But we started to call in that corner. We went all the way. The house is up there. And then we went Uko down, went all the way down, and then came up from this edge. So this is the view right now as we walk back towards the house. And then kept myself entertained. Some lollipop. I've picked this pruned tea. So we're going to help um, the fire get going using this because it's like nice and dry and large enough to do that. My friends are Ukombele ahead of me. Also, the sun didn't really set with us because it's like a cloudy, cloudy-ish evening. So it had popped out and then it kind of disappeared. So <laughs> we didn't really get to do a sunset walk, but we did get to do the walk part. So that should count for something, you know. <laughs> the fire has been set. The company set it. <laughs> the company! Hola! <laughs> I'm still struggling with this voice thing. Um, but like, the funny thing is like now, this is like a bit better compared to like the last couple of days. So I've really been struggling, so I've not been able to pick up. <laughs>